Hi there, it's Roy Breton here from GardenEquipmentReview.com. I hope you're doing well. Today uh, I've written a short article on how to prevent a tyre puncture. Now, I'm sure we've all suffered from punctures at some time in our, in our life, certainly with me and uh, with horticultural machinery. I remember in the early days it was very frustrating how you could get a puncture you know, right on mower or any machine that has a pneumatic tyre on and it literally you just lose so much time, maybe the tar wasn't in stock, maybe the tube wasn't in stock. But this puncture repellent really um, is time saver and I use it in every time I purchase a new machine, I fill it with this tar repellent. There are different makes, this is a bit particular one we're looking at today, Oco. Um, but the price varies from, I think on Amazon I saw it for yeah, seven ninety five somewhere else it's sixteen. I think they're the same size bottles, but I'll put the links on here. Um, so um, just reviews as well, eBay, and um, here I've just put how to use puncher sealant. Well, you, basically you take the um, valve out the tire. Um, make sure you keep the valve clean because I, you don't want dirt on the valve, otherwise it won't seal properly. And then. Uh, the, um, the actual sealant has, on, on the cap of the sealant, it's got a, a valve remover, so you just simply use a valve remover to unscrew the valve. Then put the tyre in the uh, 10 to 2 position and squirt the, squirt the um, material, liquid, whatever you like to call it, it's not very nice stuff, slimy stuff, but put it into the um, tyre. I probably use, like for an average, right on mower, but probably half a bottle for the rear tyres and probably a quarter of bottles, but quarter of a bottle for the front tyre. But have a look at the manufacturer's instructions. Two, two bottles would normally be enough for a ride on mower. So uh, put the stuff in, then put the uh, valve back in and then inflate the tyre, spin the tyre around so the stuff can get put all around the all around the tyre. That can be done by driving backwards and forwards or if the tyre's off just by rolling it across the ground just so it gets all in the tyre. And in this way uh, it should seal it. I would say this um, material, this Oco, probably saves 98% um, of punches. It's, it, it really is good. I, I use it all the time. I had one instant where someone had left a garden fork in some long grass and that went through the tyre. Now that did make a bigger hole and that had to be sealed professionally but in most cases uh, this will work for you so uh, take a look I'll put the links on here I uh, hope this helps and please feel free to comment on this video and comment on this blog post and like and subscribe to our channel thanks very much for watching